Welcome back to my art show. So I had to do that because YouTube won't take the whole art show like it did last week. So I have to split the art show. So sorry about that, guys. So I'm back and I'm about to finish the art show with you guys now. So when I was getting it up on YouTube, I was just fixing this area here and I've just put some purple tape and then put some sticky tape there so that's what I have done so that is what I've done yeah so now I'm about to put some clay, uh, nice tape up here and I thought I'll use the green so that's what I'm doing and then I'm going to use some beads and I'll show you why in a minute so I'm just going to do that now Might just leave that there and just pop it around because I still got to do the border. I mean, this is the front, I still got to do the border. So now I'm going to be doing the border and I'm just going to be using the tape. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So, first, I'm going to use some green, but this is how I'm going to do it. So, I'm going to cut it about like that, like a ribbon and then grab the frame and then pop the tape like that straight make sure it's straight across okay and then I'm going to do the same thing again like a ribbon and do the same thing on this side So then you've got a white like that. So that's what I want to do. So then I'm going to do the same thing on this side with the same ribbon, with the same piece of string, and then I'm going to do a different colour. So what you do is you do it like a ribbon by putting the scissors curved, move the frame, and then pop the tape. Actually, you might have to pop it there. Like that. And then the same thing again. Now that's already like a ribbon, but then just cut the edge off, corner, and then pop the same on this side. Like that. All right, now this way, I'm going to be doing a different one. So I'm not using green. I'm not using purple. I'm not using blue, but I'm using pink. So I'm going to use a pink now. And I'm going to do it like, uh, like a ribbon again by doing a curve. And I'm going to do that up the top. It might not stick because it's a bit sticky up here, but I'm just going to try. Okay, it's stuck on that side, so that's good. And I'm going to do the same thing on that side. Just a small piece. That's what I want. Now I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Now I've got some ribbon already, so now I'm just going to do it again.
and then same thing again. How nice is that? Okay. Now the finish is these beads. And I won't need clear tape. I mean, colored tape. I'll need clear tape. So what I'm going to do with these beads, I'm going to pop them on the picture frame. And sticky tape them. And now I'm going to go to sticky tape and I'm using clear tape because then you can see the beads. Now it's going to be a bit difficult to do this, I won't lie to you, but it will work. Now actually what I might do, sorry about the tape guys. I'm going to pop that like that and I'm going to pop the beads on top of that and then, okay, and then I'm going to fold the tape like that and make sure the beads are in the tape. Okay, won't need that one. Like that. Okay, um, might not work as I said, but it might work. Okay, it's not going to work. Sorry, guys. So, what I'm going to do is what I can do with these beads now. Just thinking. Alright, let's see what I can do, guys. Actually, I think I know what I could do. Might use this case. Actually, they don't. They won't. Alright. Okay. Cool. Alright. I think I know what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to pop the beads on here. And pop the tape on them. And then I'm going to... That's how I'm going to do it. So, if you have a card case or anything, you can do this as well. Just an easier way. I grab some clear tape and I guess you can stick the beads as way you want. I'm just going to stick it tape in. You can use some um, hot glue if you want to stick the beads. I'm just going to use some sticky tape. Hot glue will be might be best. Um, but this is like a little game. Now I need to explain this about it. Um, it's actually a gift idea of a game. And this game, you need beads, of course. And I'm going to sh show you in a minute what the game's all about. But first, I'm just going to get these beads ready to put on here. So the game is ready to begin. Now, games are a lot of fun to play for Valentine's Day and it's just fun to play any kind of game to tell the truth um, so it doesn't matter how you got your beads it's like 
that's how I'm going to do them. Okay, so I'm going to stick that on in a minute, but I'm going to explain the game. So you have a bag of beads, and it's like a noughts and crosses, but it isn't. It's, it, it's basically like noughts and crosses. But what you have to do, you pop the beads on the photo frame, and you have, okay, if they stop moving, okay, I'm just going to use these beads. All right, so you have a partner with you, your husband, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, whoever. And what you do is you do not touch the beads. So instead of not touching, you blow. I don't know if it will work, but... So they have to go on the other opposite side to win. So your beads basically need to go on the opposite side, so where the blue is. And then your partner tries, so you t turns around and see if your partner can blow the beads to your section and you get a point if it happens. So I just got one point. So I'm going to pretend to be my husband and I'm going to get the beads and blow it on my husband's side. So here we go. Alright, so if you can see this, that little bead there, that's on my husband's side and my husband is already blown on my side so he got one point and I got none because it's got to hit the green tape. So that's why I wanted to make this photo frame. It's basically a game called Blow the Beads game. So yeah, I hope you like it. Um, I've never made a game out of a photo frame before, but I thought that's what I wanted to do tonight for my art show, so that's what I did. So then these are the beads that are ready to play with the game. So what you do is you grab some sticky tape, And you stick the sticky tape like that. And that is called the Photo Frame Blow Beads Game. I hope you guys like my art show. I've never made a photo frame game before. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I do shows every week except Sundays. If you do do one of these games for Valentine's Day, please let me know. Take some photos. Send them on my media. I'm on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, and Facebook. I would love to see your game. I love you guys a lot. Thank you very much for all the support, the sweet comments, and I'll see you again tomorrow night, probably for a vlog or probably for a cooking vlog. I love you guys a lot. Thank you. Bye.